I can't believe Pokimane's latest response on the stream to her new controversy and allegations of her scamming, ripping off her fans. She is an absolute grade A moron. Like if you agree, and let's get into it. So if you're unaware of the situation, Pokimane launched a brand new line of cookies. It's really on brand for Pokimane to launch cookies. So I just constantly felt like I had to choose between eating something yummy, but kind of feeling bad or guilty about it, or eating something healthy, maybe feeling like I did something good, but never really wanting to reach for it again because it did not taste good at all. In comes... <laughs> Minor. Already looking like a cash grab, however, once you dive into the product, it's one of the biggest cash grabs you've ever seen. Pokimane's brand and cookies got accused and proven to rip off another brand, Totsie's Midnight Mini Cookies. Exactly the same name, exactly the same looking cookies, exactly the same nutritional values, exactly the same ingredients. It was clear all Pokimane has done here was slap her label on it, logo, and charge, get this, over double the price. The Totsies Midnight Mini Cookies retailed in Costco for $10 or $9.99. Pokimane's cookies retail for $28 for a four pack. The bag of cookies she's selling are four ounces. So a four pack of cookies is really only 16 ounces of cookies for $28, but Totsies ones were $9.99 for 14 ounces. So you can see the massive, enormous markup, pure greed, Pokimane truly ripping off her fans. She pictured in this video as a new idea. So I just constantly felt like I had to choose between eating something yummy, but kind of feeling bad or guilty about it, or eating something healthy, maybe feeling like I did something good, but never really wanting to reach for it again because it did not taste good at all. In comes <laughs> Mina. Something that you know, she created and loved making two years in the making. Sorry, I love seeing these behind me. Like, it brings me so much joy. Two years, bro. Two years. That's also another lie that came to light is this company was founded in February this year. Once this all gets exposed, Pokemon comes out with a pretty bullshit statement. Very corporate, very much to please her fans and not the people criticizing her. Because after she claimed, you know, the product's original. They... We basically made this brand because why are there not more snacks that are simply healthy, tasty? Created it, said so on the website. Pokimane comes out and says, actually guys, we partnered with a brand, took their formula and improved it. We're sourcing it from so many different places. The ingredients aren't similar. Which again, one is a lie. The ingredients are exactly the same. And two, oh, so now you're admitting to it. Now you're saying, oh no, guys, we kind of just like are redoing the formula with like improving it before you said you created this product so i just constantly felt like i had to choose between eating something yummy but kind of feeling bad or guilty about it or eating something healthy maybe feeling like i did something good but never really wanting to reach for it again because it did not taste good at all in comes <laughs> Mina. We basically made this brand because why are there not more snacks that are simply healthy, tasty? Your website says the cookies were created. This is nothing more than an absolute bullshit cash grab from Pokimane. Even went as far as to say them it's worth it to their viewers and she wouldn't ask unless it was worth their money. I don't want you guys spending your money on something unless it's really, really worth your money. You're literally charging $18 more for what, two ounces extra. So now as I'll explain to you guys who don't know, Pokimane is clearly letting the criticism get to her because she just said one of the most moronic, idiotic statements I think I've ever seen her do. And I love it because in this clip, she's so arrogant. She's so sure she's right trying to defend herself. And she just looks like a complete and utter idiot. So this was her response to this drama on stream. When people are like, oh my god, $28 for cookies? It's four bags. That's seven, seven dollars a bag. I know, I know math is hard when you're an idiot, but uh, like if you're a broke boy, just say so. Oh, yeah. Anyways. This clip really summarizes why so many people dislike Pokemon. The way she speaks, so condescending, and she's just a moron. Number one Pokemon, math 
I know it is hard. Hard for you, clearly, because you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. On your website, the cookies you're selling, the bags are four ounces. You're selling a four pack for $28. Four times four is 16. You're selling 16 ounces for $28. The cookies before you slapped your name on it, jacked up the price to rip off your fans, them cookies for 14 ounces were $9.99. So clearly the markup has been absolutely insane. You only provide two ounces more for over double the price. Almost triple the price. And here you are on stream going, guys, like, do you guys not know how to do maths? When people are like, oh my god, $28 for cookies? It's four bags. That's seven, seven dollars a bag. I know, I know math is hard. Ben, you're so out of touch. So out of touch with reality going, guys, seven dollars a bag of cookies? Like, what, you broke? When you're an idiot, but uh, look, if you're a broke boy, just say so. Okay, yeah. Who the fuck pays seven dollars for a four ounce bag of cookies? That is the most out of touch, rich, influencer, millionaire bullshit I've ever heard. And such a defensive response. Instead of looking at the criticism and being like, man, you know what? I did slap my name on something, jack up the price to try and make a quick buck out of my fans. You're saying shit like this. What an absolute joke and really reminds me every drama Pokimane's in, her response, the way she talks is always never the right thing. She never will come out and just admit to being wrong or say the right thing. She will always do some shit like this. When people are like, oh my God, $28 for cookies? It's four bags. That's seven seven dollars a bag i know i know math is hard like if you're a broke boy just say so okay, yeah. anyway. he has to be easily one of the most unlikable streamers of all time leave a like if you agree you're calling people broke but you're the one ripping fans off with cookies to try and make some money like i i saw this clip and i knew it i was like i have to talk about this i can't let that slide one bit she is just a complete disaster the launch of her cookies was a disaster that's what you get pokimane when you try and pull the wool over people's eyes and then you get exposed the money grabbing greedy annoying influencer you are that is it for this video like if you agree subscribe for more loads more content coming until next time fuck off broke boy broke boy bro Oh,